uswaterrockets.com water rocket construction tutorial programming the do-it-yourself launchpad altimeter launch your internet browser and go to uswaterrockets.com it happens to be our home page as shown here navigate the menu bar to the launchpad altimeter menu and then click on the firmware download link always download the firmware from this link as it will be the most current release make a note of the name and location where you save the archive Next, you will need the firmware programming tool. Navigate your web browser to lprotronic.com. And go to their download link. Scroll down the page and near the bottom you'll locate the free FETPRO 430 Lite download link. Download the archive now and remember the location where you save it. You can now close your browser and open the folder location where you save the downloads. Open the firmware archive and extract the FET430PRJ project file to a folder on your computer. The exact name of the firmware archive, as well as the file itself, may differ slightly from that shown in this video as we release new versions with additional features. Now you can open the FETPRO430 Lite archive and run the setup.exe installer application. Accept the licensing agreement and the subsequent installation options dialogs as the default settings are fine for this application. Once complete, you can bypass the README dialog and close the installer. The FETPRO 430 Lite icon should now appear on your desktop, but don't run it just yet. You need to install the USB drivers first. To install the USB drivers, Connect the launchpad altimeter to your computer using the USB cable. Make sure that the battery is never connected at the same time that you plug in the USB cable or you could damage your computer or the battery. The USB driver should now automatically install. If you check the progress of the installation, you may find that the MSP430 application UART driver is not found. This driver is not needed for firmware programming, so there is no need to correct this issue and you can continue without it. You can now launch the FETPRO430 Lite software. In the file menu, navigate to the FET430PRJ project file and open it. All you need to do now is click on the Auto Program button. The software does the rest. The program may warn you that the type connected does not match. This is fine and you can click yes to continue. The firmware process will now complete and you should see pass in big green letters to let you know it was successful. You can now close down the programming utility and disconnect your launchpad altimeter from the USB cable. Your launchpad altimeter is now programmed and ready for flight. Click the video link shown here to see related videos. You can see the web page version of this tutorial. You can see the Launchpad Altimeter Assembly tutorial. Or you can see a video about our high pressure water rocket electronics. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss any updates. See you next time.